You know, I think the fall of 2017 for me in reflection was probably one where coming into it's the most momentum maybe the program's ever had and from competitive success. The way that the, the final four truly energized our program. But when the men got back to campus, honestly, it was very, very business-like, you know, very, very similar to what last year felt like in the year before that. But I think what made this fall different is the conversation that we had to have as a staff to say, okay, listen, how do we use this incredible run that we had, although we fell one game short, to propel us, to, to build momentum, but also not to make sure that it, it's, it's something that is a detraction. I think the men are just collectively, they understand what it takes, how much work went into last year, and I think they're excited to, to get back to the process of what it's going to take to, to try to be successful. The fall is, is always, a, you know, again, it's a fascinating kind of time. On the field itself, um, you know, everybody starts to, again, fall into the pecking order of, wow, that freshman's pretty good or wow, that senior's got a different attitude this year. Uh, and you see people start to recognize each other. December is a time where you, know, you want to spend time with loved ones. Uh, you want to make sure that you have a good fe feeling individually of like where you are physically. You know, you've worked so hard this off season. Okay, where's my body fat? Where's my weight? And then you really put it in their hands. With uh, the evolution of technology, with iPads, and you know, we're able to send them home uh, with a, a great winter program and the hopes that they would get in the weight room, you know, where they will find a wall to, to, to stay sharp. There is this also balance where you want them to put the stick down, you want them to rest and recover, you want them to relax for a couple weeks and really come back passionate and excited about playing lacrosse. First day of class is January 10th, and for the first time, we're gonna start practice on January 10th. You know, on the first day, it's um, do your best, and we'll figure out the rest. We'll figure out what needs to be adjusted or what we, what we need to do. But I think those first three or four days of practice, we want to get guys reassimilated into being an athlete again. Um, the other thing is we know they're going to throw the ball away. We know they're going to drop it. We know that's going to happen day two. Hopefully it happens a little less. And by the time we're ready to have contact, you know, their bodies are, you know, back and prepared and ready to go. You know, I want to see a sense of urgency, I think most importantly. You know, I think a group that's hungry, a team that's, that's got a chip on their shoulder, you know, to make sure that the focus is on how can we have the best January we've ever had in Buckeye Lacrosse and then go into those first few games with that sense of urgency that we had a year ago.